Hello, this is Robert Smith from M2 Technologies here to tell you about archive files in Simulation Mechanical. Archive files are like a zipped folder containing all of the data required by a Simulation Mechanical model. When opening a Sim Mechanical model, you go for the .fem file, that's kind of like the entry point for the model, but the real meat of the model is contained in the nearby subfolder. So if you want to send this model to another user, or maybe tech support, or maybe you just want to save a copy of the entire model in its current state before making further changes, it's not enough just to grab the FEM file. To ensure you get everything you need, use the archive tool. Here you see a completed model, with results. To create an archive file, find the archive command in the application menu. Here you'll see several options. You could create an archive, which we'll look at in a second. Retrieve opens an existing archive. Manage Existing allows you to add, remove, or update files in an existing archive. And Delete does just what it says. You can also just delete the archive right in Windows Explorer, by the way. If you hit Create, it will ask you to select a location and name for the archive file, which uses the .ach extension. Next, it will ask you whether you want a model-only archive, which contains only setup information, or one that includes all of the results you have already run. Model only will save disk space, and these files can get pretty large depending on the analysis type. It will contain everything the user on the other end would need to get the exact same results you did, but they'll have to run it again. Make your selection and hit OK, and it will begin the process of compressing the FEM and the contents of its related subfolders. OK, archive successfully created. Let's take a look at what it made. This is the archive file. The original model was just under 6 gigs. And the archive file, model only in this case, is only 367 meg. In order to open an archive file, go to the application menu, archive, retrieve. Select the archive file and hit open. It's going to ask you to select where you want to unpack it. By default that would be the same folder where the archive file sits. But you can specify otherwise. It will then unpack the archive and open the FEM and send mechanical. Alternatively, you just use the open command to unpack your archive. When you hit open, SimMech will be looking for an FEM file, so you won't see archives unless you select .ach from the Files of Type drop-down. Select the file and open it, and from here the process is the same. Double-clicking on the archive in Windows Explorer would have the same effect. 